Hello everyone, this is a small tutorial about the free uh, espresso rig. Um, it's a setup for a Christmas uh, lights. Uh, if you want to create a Christmas lights yourself, you can watch the tutorial uh, on my uh, YouTube account. It's uh, part one and part two. You can completely create uh, the Christmas lights yourself. Um, but if you want to uh, use this one, it's okay. Um, I made a small um, espresso uh, setup where you can easily use on any spline and it will transform your spline into a um, nice cute Christmas robes with a few settings and I'll show you how to do that. The first thing you see around here is um, the change settings. If you press this button, you see here uh, a few items you can change. Uh, it's very important that you don't mess up this rig because then um, the whole scene will be lost. Um, for the example of this material, I picked just a, a small uh, fence and I made a spline. And the spline are wrapped around this fence and when you put the spline over here into the source spline it will automatically set up these Christmas lights for you. There are a few things you can change. First thing you can change is the number of lights. I put around 19 but you can also change this to 1 and it will have just one light. Increase the number and it will automatically put some more lines onto the spline. Next thing you can change is the alignment of, this, of the lights. In this case it's really nice that they face all kinds of directions. But if you turn this off they will face upwards. Next thing you can do is change the size. They will become really big. like that and what you can do is change the size of the wire it will also become much larger and you can change this number as well and it will change the spins around each other like this other things you can change is of course the color of light. If you leave it like this on the white and you put on this button it will give a random color to each one of the lights. Turn it off again and if you just only want one color pick a color you like and then it will turn into a really blue, change it to red, change it back to white again, or just random. I'll do a quick render to show you how it looks like. And what also is important when you increase, of course, the size of the lights, they will turn also brighter. So just um, make them a little bit smaller again. This stick is way too big. Uh, not a lot smaller. Quick render again. Okay, what else can you do? Is I put in a just a Christmas tree and around the Christmas tree I put a helix just a normal helix helix you can find inside this menu just change the settings a little and then I follow the curve of the tree okay put your helix into the source spline and then you see the lights will show up now on the Christmas tree. 
what else you need to change is what I think uh, is more natural is you change the alignment they will all face up and maybe we need more light to fill up the spline put off the random color make a quick render okay there it is and of course when you think these are too tiny you can always increase uh, the size and the spins of uh, the setup just uh, change the numbers over here and everything will be automatically changed Okay, where can you find this free setup? I'll show you. Just go to devinart.com and check the profile. My profile is uh, Dino Cloud, and in that profile you can find uh, the download. Uh, link to get this free uh, file. Um, the only thing you need is you have to have a login on DeviantArt and that's free also. So have fun with this free setup and maybe see you next time on another tutorial. Bye!